Hey y'all, it's Sammy. I'm here in Seven Days to Die, and uh, my world that I run on my land, so my family and I can play, and I've been playing Alpha 20, Age of Oblivion, for about a week now. Thought I'd show you around my base a little bit. Oh, what's going on that way? Okay, let's take care of these zombies real quick. Oh, okay. Oh, hey, Mr. Vampire. Goodbye, Mr. Vampire. Okay, what is going on around here? And no, this is not my base. I'm just at a POI. Oh, hey, here's an oblivion box. Let me get rid of these vampires. He's just down my first. Oh, I think we have bugs incoming. Oh, crud. We do. I hear him. Where are you guys? Come on. What the heck? Dog fell in and there they are. Come on guys. You can't get out, can you? A deer is in there? Seriously? Yep, yep, yep. Bug problem. We got bugs. I have to go down here and get rid of these guys. Smash him. Smash him. Smash. Yeah, I'm sorry, dog. Ah. Uh, one of the interesting things that Age of Oblivion has added are these bugs underground. And new sounds to zombies. Okay, I think. Oh, and I killed the dog. Darn it. There's also many pets added to the game. Wild animals. Let's check out the Oblivion box. These will spawn around the world. Usually have some good stuff in them. Uh, banana cream pie and a mini bike chassis in this one. Not great, but not bad either. Some new trees. This is the sugar maple. No, sorry. This is the white oak. Uh, maybe we'll have some... We'll see a sugar maple. Oh, it's back there. With the yellow leaves. It's a sugar maple. Okay. Oh, zombie. Growl yourself. Uh, lemon tree. Sheep. And some roses. Here's a secret trader. This is for advanced stuff. Okay, fine. And once you spec into it, you can even harvest the zombies. And get... Bones and zombie flesh and yep, really kind of cool. So I do have that open. I'll show you my skills real quick. Under Age of Oblivion, there's all of these wonderful skills. Uh, I only have one in Zombie Harvest because I wasn't doing that. Uh, my husband Silver was, but I maxed out 
the alchemy and extra health and stamina, extra tool block damage, a little bit of salvaging. Mainly I'm the farmer. The farmer and cooker, as well as the cloner. So let's show you my base. Oh, do you like my truck? I was able to unlock it pretty close to the beginning. Oh, there's a water buffalo. Okay, don't need the water buffalo. My base is over here. There's the big barn. I just got done finishing that barn, actually. One of my human guards is up on top of this rock, keeping lookout. He's watching the road, making sure nobody comes in. Okay, we'll go around the barn here. Here's my hell lion. Don't worry, just a pussy. Just a pussy cat. Eh, maybe not. Okay, well, hell lion's in the barn. Great. Probably we'll have to kill the pussycat. Yep. Well, that just sucks. You're not killing my cows. I have to clone another one. Oh well. Okay, so here are my Scotland cattle. You harvest them, they give you Kobe beef, of all things. It's great stuff. And over here are my milking cows. Oh, they're ready to be milked. What do you know? Also added by Age of Oblivion. Lots and lots of recipes. Lots of milk. And they require the animal feed, which I have a ton of in my inventory at the moment. I do not have any other animals in here right now, but I'm planning on having some eggling chickens. Oh, yeah, sorry, forgot about the pigs. I do have pigs in here. Uh, but I'm planning on putting in some egg-laying chickens and probably some more animals. We'll see what I get. Uh, so sad. Had to kill the pussycat. Alright, let's go in the base. I have some trees growing over here. Lemons, limes. Ooh, my limes tree is ready. So is my lemon. I'll get my scythe out and harvest them. Gonna take a little bit, just give me a minute. There we go, 40 limes. And 36 lemons, not bad. My cacao trees are still seedlings right here. I harvested them earlier. I do have some more bandits looking out for me here. This guy uses a stun baton. Anybody gets too close and he zaps him. And he's the leader of the band here. He likes to just stand here and shoot things. And over here, I'm sure you saw as we were coming up, I have a hell bear. Just shooting at something up there. Let's go find out. I like shooting at anything that moves. This is Lizzie. She's got that nice Tommy gun. Don't ask her why your eyes are red. Um, well, she was pointing in this direction. Wonder what she killed this time. Maybe another rabbit. Eh, who knows? Who cares? And over on this side, 
of the mountain. Oh, there she is. Here's Foxy. They're both keeping an eye on the top of the mountain here. Eh. Okay. I don't know where Pumpkin Man went off to. What are you what are you shooting at over there? Seriously. What are you shooting at? Another rabbit? It's like you're shooting into the ground. And yeah, that is seems to be a bug with it. They will actually shoot through dirt. I tried to have a pet cat in the uh in the base and they killed it. Because again they shoot anything that moves. I have no idea what you're shooting at. There's nothing up here. Okay. Well Oh I just saw it. She shoot she's shooting at the dog. Really? You're shooting at the dog. You're as bad as the drone. There's a horse. It'll be dead soon. Unfortunately. And... Oh, there's a skull chamber over here. I forgot we had one so close to base. Haven't gotten in those yet. I'm too busy building base. Here's a deer. Regular doe. Uh, you saw the buck that had fallen into the bug pit earlier. Um, I don't think I have readily available a uh, trash pit to show you. That's fine. Uh, they're basically just really huge, long drops into the ground with trash at the bottom. They're meant to be uh, pits. Trap pits. Okay, let's go check out my base. Uh, we actually dug into the side of the mountain. Took a while, but we did it. Alright. Need to repair that vault. Two vault doors. Double protection. Close the doors. So here's the Age of Oblivion quest table. You can take all of your quests here. I set up a little sitting area here. This is Silver's drone. He's logged out for now. Here is our garden uh, and his uh, little piece of artwork. The farm table. You can get all of the seeds that we need. We just put a box up here with all the different seeds and seed packs we've gotten. We're holding on to them honestly until we know, all, know everything that we need. Um, we need a lot of corn and a lot of wheat for animal feed and flour so that's what most of our garden is, is corn corn wheat the corn is vanilla so you harvest it it disappears the wheat is age of oblivion it automatically goes back to seed i think i can probably harvest all this now Okay, and then other things that we found that we needed a lot of were not watermelon, herbs, and spices. So we have several of those, vanilla potatoes, carrots, I know, it's still growing. It's carrots, celery, broccoli, this is ginger. Ooh, the squash is ready. Oh, good. <laughs> I need some mixed veggies. Jalapenos. Here's our marijuana for special brownies. 
and some vanilla and some more wheat it grows really slow back here for some reason onions tomatoes vanilla mushrooms sugar cane yep that's basically all we're growing right now and here is our lovely kitchen we went very simplistic style sit down low on your knees eat at the table we have our grill which I just made cheeseburgers so that's why it's highlighted there and our smoker I need to find honey to make this honey glazed ham we have an ice maker to make ice a whole bunch of different ice and our drink maker can make a ton of different drinks we have been drinking mostly the citrus splash soda, hence the lemon and the lime. And let's see, what else have we been really drinking? As you can see, there's a ton of them. We want to try Dr. Jen's soda at some point. That looks really good. And the ginger ale also looks really good. But we've mainly been doing the strawberry soda because you can find strawberries in the wild harvest them get a ton of them and then you can make strawberry soda and then our ice cream maker which we're still working on sugar so uh, we've got our milk condition under control but we still got to get sugar so no ice cream for us yet our pizza oven which I have two of here it's one of the best foods in the game I keep them as a reserve because 175 and I think my, my food is like 180. Let me look. Yeah, 187. So yeah, I have to be almost starving to get the full benefit. And then, I know you can't really see it very well, but the uh, deep fryer. Uh, we may do a blooming onion at some point. Ooh, falafels. I didn't see that. Ooh, let me do those next. And then our gas oven, which the last thing I was making was Royal Game Pie. That's why that's in there. But tons and tons of different recipes. Eventually we'll make beef with broccoli once we start planting rice. And then our refrigerator for a whole bunch of more jello. Last game. Silver made jello and it was like 500 jello in a box because he didn't realize that they made so much. <laughs> we had jello for like weeks in game. Um, our KitchenAid, which of course, yes, I can make flour right now because I have corn on me and wheat on me. Another reason why I grow a lot of wheat. I, we end up using mostly <coughs> the mixed veggies down here and the freshly kneaded dough and the chocolate bar for those special brownies. Speaking of special brownies, special brownies, yes. And we have some too. So here is all the food that I've made or collected so far. I've gotten a lot of them through the Oblivion crates, but made special brownies and royal game pie, bacon meatloaf, ramen, spaghetti and meatball meatballs. Oh, that took that was a pain to get. So much pasta. Uh, cabbage rolls and coffee we actually found. Of course, we have some vanilla stuff in here. Made some fresh cheeseburgers, barbecue pork ribs, excellent. We lived off of that for probably the first 15 days because we found a whole bunch of barbecue sauce. And so I was able to make a whole bunch of barbecue pork ribs. And most of this, though, I we actually picked up through the Oblivion boxes. So uh, it was great to get those, especially first game. Uh, this is all of our meat. I've made some ham. Here's the raw Kobe beef, the pork ribs, 
but when you harvest the animals you get raw beef raw pork raw poultry I've made some wine I'll show you that in a moment here's my chocolate wild wild game steaks yep and our sauce because we have to have our pizza of course and then this is where we're putting currently everything that we have found that are base ingredients grapes mushrooms corn eggs lemon lime potatoes we're at a point right now where we don't harvest the garden very often because we just don't need it except for some things like broccoli and I got to get that rice planted too. I may plant it outside. I have to get that ho 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 quest done, which is over here, I believe. Yep, this one. I haven't done this yet. Quest ho ho hoes. Kill 20 strippers to get the garden hoe. And that's what I need. We don't have a garden hoe yet. Okay, so I showed you the kitchen. Over here is a storage area. We just try to break it up as best we can uh, using the new 820 building materials here's that maple wood planks and white oak planks from the two new trees you'll need those a resurrection potion I don't have a resurrection table out right now um, yep and then just some minor healing stuff. We haven't found many healing stuff, but we need steroids and blood bags for our cloning so they get kept here, along with our cryo materials, DNA, and car keys. And just some generic resources that we have built up. Here's our skull tokens. As I said, we haven't gone to any of the skull chambers yet. That's on our next thing to do. Once we get enough keys, which we haven't really been... Where did I put those keys? Oh, I'll find them. Uh, we haven't really been keeping them. So, uh, we just got to start collecting them. The laser ammo we have been keeping because once we do get laser weapons from the secret trader, we'll need them. Um, otherwise, yep, just, just basic stuff. You know, our, all of the stuff that we have learned is over here. Need a quick bedroom. I mean, you, you have to make yourself a base that actually feels like home. Come on. And then on this side is the other half of the kitchen, if you can call it that. Here's our butcher table where we can take all of the main cuts and turn them into good cuts like ground beef and chicken breasts and bacon and the pork ribs sausage yeah lots of stuff we lived actually on steaks steaks and pork ribs for the first 15 days because that's what we happened to get and oh i left the brew station on bad 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 uh well i need to make some more milk here so I'll pasteurize 20 milk, raw milk into milk, and then over here, oh, I forgot the salt. One moment, let me, let me grab some salt. Do, 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 do. This is our dairy churn, and, oh, I have milk for cheese. Well, I'll just make some butter right now. That'll give me tin butter. So I'll have 40 to pick up in a moment. And then this is the alchemy bench. This is all the way upgraded. It's at level 3. And that's another thing that we're starting to do is to get stuff to make all of these wonderful potions so that we can get some of the really good in-game stuff. And some of the animal Things that we have collected. Each animal gives you different resources. Let's see, how far along am I on the milk? There we go, I'll turn that off. Ooh, it's night. It just turned night. Okay, good thing we're home. So, this is my cloning area. And the cloning stations actually require light 
So just like the greenhouses that have, ooh, come on, they have the shafts going all the way to the surface, and there's a grate up there so that nothing can fall in. We actually have the same in here. So we have one shaft here, and then we have one shaft over here. Well, let's see, because this is my cloning. I'm probably going to have to make, where is it, the egg-wing chicken clone chamber, so that I can get some egg-wing chickens. Uh, I'll go through those eggs pretty quickly. Let's see what we get here. Come here. Human guard. And another turret Lizzie. Nice. You can go again. These have all been upgraded to stage 2. Uh, all three required about 150 gold nuggets. Kill the geese. They give gold. Alright. And we got a guard rabbit. Mm -hmm. Okay. And for the pet, an incomplete clone. Okay. Well, let me... I have the transmorgifier box over here. Let's see, I can change... Oh, I don't have any animal DNA. But you can change the incomplete clone and choose a pet of your choice. And as you can see, there's tons and tons of pets in here. Everything that you find in the wild can technically be made into a pet. So zebras, dogs, rabbits, pugs, cattle... Yes, I know it has a cat, but there is cattle out there. And not just the ones in the barn. I think there's three different versions. Okay. And then just a box here for clone stuff. We have several clones here waiting. See? Goose. Uh, we have several clones here waiting to get put out eventually. And then over here was originally going to be the workroom. Uh, we've wanted enough space to have two oblivion tables should we need it because this is your main workbench this acts as a workbench so all of your ammo has to be made here all of your workbenches have to be made here most everything ends up being made on this workbench so we wanted to have enough space to put in two and we put in the advanced to forge we have it fully decked out with all of the levels of bellows. And it looks like it is done smelting everything, so... Oh good, Silver turned it off before he logged out. Alright. Oh, and of course our cement mixer. Uh, but we have enough space that we can actually expand if we need to. Oh... They're shooting at something up there. But yep, so that's my base. Um, this is all in Alpha 20, Age of Oblivion. And... Trying to figure out what I was going to do next. So I have a bunch of things here. I do not have the resurrection table uh, currently built. It is bugged at the moment, so I ended up destroying it. Uh, just simply because why have it? I had to have it outside in order to get it to work, right? And even then, I couldn't get the zombie guard off of it. I could only destroy it, so. But that's, that's the base. So I wanted to say... Yeah, that it's, it's been fun so far. I do have... A lot to do left. But hopefully you enjoyed it. I will talk to you later. Let me know if you have any questions. I'm almost always available in the evenings on the Age of Oblivion Discord. Have a good night.